Greetings, greetings, greetings. If you can hear me and see my screen, say we can hear you and we can see your screen. Let's see why there's no screen. Right now, you should be able to see the action machine. You should be able to see the action machine. Wait. Okay, you, you should be able to see the action machine. Let me know if you can see it. Today what we are going to cover, we're going to cover media buys. I, I want to lay the foundation for each and every one of you. Uh, this is uh, just the intro to media bias. I think this is such an important uh, topic where you can generate hundreds of thousands of leads fast, right? And do some big things fast. But there are certain things which you absolutely need to have in place before you come and play over here. Because if you do it the wrong way, you can lose your shirt fast, right? So this is an amazing way to generate good quality traffic to any offer, but it has to be done right. Before we get into that, I just wanted to share the action machine with you guys, right? It's a tool which has really increased my productivity, right? Uh, why? As you can see right now, I've got a lot of check marks on my art on my screen so what happens is I do not finish my day until each and every check mark is green right now I am doing a webinar with you guys you can see there's a countdown timer once it reaches zero it's going to tell me that what that task is completed right and I have to say what I can co continue with it or do whatever. What I do to increase my productivity is I don't do anything until the task is finished. I don't check Facebook. I don't check Twitter. I don't go out onto LinkedIn. I don't answer my phone. I don't do anything until a task is finished. Why did I feel it's important to show you this? I had uh, a meeting with someone uh, this afternoon. They told me they spend about um, eight hours a day on their computer working hard. So I asked that person to share their screen on Skype and show me exactly what they did today, right? They had already spent their eight hours of the day and what they showed me was something a person can do in 30 minutes. And I walked them through each and everything they did. And it could have been executed in 30 minutes, not eight hours. And guess what? They were on Twitter. They were on Skype. They were on Facebook. They were everywhere. But they were not producing things for their business. In life, you get paid for what or where you have sold. Does that make sense? 
If you do not sow, you are not going to reap anything. There is no harvest. There is zero harvest coming. This is extremely important that you know what you are doing when you sit down to do your work. It's absolutely, absolutely important. I hope you got it. Uh, this action machine is pretty cheap. I think I bought it for 39 or so, right? So let's just uh, get rid of the action machine. Let's get into what I wanted, what I want to cover with you guys. I'm not going to take too much of your time, right? I want to go through just the intro, right? Um, with the media buys, there are certain things which you need to know about media buys. You get massive amounts of traffic and you can scale up to any any size, right? There are benefits to doing media buys, things like if you are buying direct, this is when you are buying direct, you can control the quality, there's low competition, there's a easy optimization of your, your pages, and you can create a long-term portfolio, like if you are using things like uh, uh, Yahoo, um, those can give you what, traffic for a very long time. If you go to places like the Huffington Post, all of those, those are sources where you can get massive amounts of traffic continuous on a continuous uh, basis, right? So one of the things which I need to let you know ahead of time is when you're doing media buys, right, you need to use tried and tested capture pages. You cannot go and do media buys while you're still in the testing phase, right? You'll be wasting your time. So as you all know, I like to use tools, right? If you look here, this is a tool which I use. It's called uh, Black Pops, right? What Black Pops is, it scrapes the internet to see the capture paging, capture pages which are receiving the most amount of traffic, right? You can see here, I click on what? You can either click on the newest, uh, and you can see what capture pages are receiving the most, uh, are the newest, right? What are people trying? The problem with, uh, or the challenge with using this new capture pages, you don't know if it's going to convert or not. What I personally like to do is, I come over here, right, and I check out the most active capture pages, the things which people are using, look at the structure. If I really want to dig deep, I can even what? Go to see the actual capture pages. This is seems like the mobile version. I don't want the mobile version. Let's see to the other one, tracking link. Let's see this one. Looks so tiny. Um, you can check the traffic data. How much traffic has been sent to that page? Uh, it's currently ranked number 64,166, which is good. Time spent on site, which is very high, is brilliant. Daily views, the visitor, nice. Okay, most of their, they've got uh, total linkings, warrior forum. Mm, this is a good site, I need to pay attention to this site. Keywords. But there isn't much data here, but just based on those things, I can see they get some good quality uh, traffic, right? 
So I like the capture page. There's nothing fancy. You can make fun, you can make money fast with mobile phones. Learn how you can cash in on the mobile boom right now. Okay. I can the way I'll do this, right? Sorry, I'm this is a little bit off topic. I know they're getting a lot of traffic to this site. I'll just go take their URL and do PPVs targeting what that particular URL, but this one's for phones, it won't be relevant because I only do desktops. Let's see again. So why am I doing this? I want to take what's already working. That's the thing which I'm going to use when I do my media buys, right? Because media buys is like you're opening a faucet, right? You're opening a faucet. You're going to places where there is a lot of traffic. Some of these places, um, I know there are some places where you have to spend not less than $25,000 a day, right? That's how, that's the kind of traffic I'm talking about, right? As you already know about me, I don't like to reinvent the wheel. I like to copy what's already working. So I use a lot, a lot of tools, right? So what I have seen is the kind of pages which do very well when it comes to media buys are things like this one. Where are you? If you look at the way this is done, right, that normally does very well. If you look at uh, the way this one is done, these ones do very, very, very well, right? Uh, there's one more which I've seen. See something like this? With a person, they already you know a popular familiar figure like Dr. Oz. Those traditionally do extremely, extremely well. So the way I like to do it, right? You go over here, right? These are the most popular pages. These are the pages which get the most amount of traffic, right? So let's just choose one. Let's say this one, for instance, right? We come over here. They say these are the, what? the links to that to to the page. Let's see. Our okay, camera's taking me back. Let's go through traffic here. Okay, this is the site, right? Unfortunately, they do not have any data on this. I want one way the way we can see the data. Guys, we are on the research phase, right? Uh, this is just an intro. I'm going to break down media buys and everything in later modules. This is this one. This is a CPA of, uh, let's see, give me a second. CBS. That's a news channel. I don't like news channels. Why is the news channel advertising? Um, I'm looking for a capture page which gets a lot of traffic, which we can try. Do you want to learn about a system that helped me generate over 176,000 online in less than 30 days? Click here to get a blueprint, okay? Let's see here. Let's see over here. Okay, 61,000. Okay, let's see. What I'll do, I'll take their URL, right? Copy it. Go into another tool. 
which is a follow. I've shown you guys follow before. And what I do, I paste it in here and I hit search. Right? You can see they've, they get a lot of traffic. They get a lot of traffic. They don't play around. Oh, this guy is very big in the what call it in the media buying world. I mean he's very big. So I know he's hiding most of his things because obviously a lot of people will be copying him. Basically, I was trying to see where he advertises, but he is smart. Most of the things are hidden, but he uses uh, a lot of what? 50 on red, lead impact, and traffic vents, right? So I'm going to be doing a lot of that. He's targeting willycrawford.com. Hmm. What is that watching Arthur? Is my internet gone or am I still here? Internet is still good. Why are these not? For some reason I can't open these uh, links. This URL, uh, let me see. Let me just check something. My internet is still good. Internet is good. I don't know for some reason this URLs are not opening. Okay. Okay, there we go. I just wanted to check why this site is being targeted because I see it's being targeted and supposedly sending a lot of traffic. It doesn't look nothing special about this. All I can do is just to copy without reinventing the wheel. So let me just find a different example. Okay, this one, instant. Because he's hiding most of his things. Okay, here we are getting a lot more, a lot, 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 a lot more. You can see exactly where they are spending their money, the keywords they are targeting, the the top text ads, and how long those ads have been running, right? Like this one, 44 days and all those things. They are making money from these ads, so those ads, those sites can be targeted, like media buys now. You can see where they are spending most of their money. Like this one, they deal with a lot of different sites. What I'm going to do, I'm going to go through 
the ins and outs of negotiating contracts. That's why I said it's very important that we take at least four days covering media buys alone, right? You can see the most of the sites where they, they, they are placing their ads, but what I don't like is the number of days they have been seen, right? That I don't like. So let's take a look at uh, this network here. The top one where they are spending most of their money. I've got it open already. It was... Not... That's Airblade. Oh, here we go. Right? This is... Uh, let me just go to the home page. Now, this is a collection of different sites. It's not just one site where you just go and negotiate directly with a site like uh, Huffington Post. Also, Huffington, Huffington Post, right? Huffington Post, guys, here you are going to spend at least 25000 dollars to place your ads. So this is definitely for the big boys, right? So let's break it down, right? So I've just shown you exactly how to do your research, right? How to find capture pages which are already converting when it comes to media buys. Let's look at this again. Let me just show you. I don't think I showed you properly. If we go in here, right, these people, they are spending most of their money on what media buys. Would you agree? They're spending most of their money on media buys, right? They're doing a lot of media buys, right? So how did we find this site? If you look here, right, they're going direct to sites and whatever, right? Most of their money is spent what? with what media buys. So we know that, right? And over here, the way we found them, we found their capture page under one of the what, most active what capture pages online, which tells us that the capture page works. So all you need to do is to copy that capture page, make it a little bit more congruent to what you are offering, right, and put it out there. Now you've got a capture page which has been tested with media buys, right? Then the next step is we found the capture page which is working well with media buys. Where are they buying their media, right? Most of their media is being spent where? Buy sell ads. Right? You know that. Now, if you look at here, these are the top publishers. That means the top sites where their ads are what? Are being run on. Are you guys seeing a pattern here? Are you seeing how you can just become very successful in something you are, which you are completely clueless about and do it? properly and well. This is the site where they are getting a lot of traffic. A lot of traffic from. It's under one of the, their top producers. So you can go directly to these sites and not negotiate to place your, your banner as there and you know, things like that. So buying through networks, right? When you buy through networks, let me just show you again. This is what we call a network, right? It's a collection of all the different, uh, what you call it, different um, websites. It's a network. Uh, when you go directly to like Huffington Post, you're yeah, buying direct, right? Another one, another network is this one, Adblade. It's a network which carries thousands um, of what different sites and they cannot they can send massive amounts of traffic for you. Like you can see, they've got uh, Yahoo, ABC, and all those things. These are no small sites. These are huge, 
huge size, right? You can see they have a potential of reaching over 300 million users. That's nothing to sneeze about. So you can go through networks, or you can go directly, right? Now, when you go through networks, right, um, networks can be a collection of many, many different sites, right? They've got um, managed, hybrid, and self-served, self, self, uh, where you basically do yourself everything. Examples of that, Adblade, advertising.com. Um, we also have uh, Yahoo and uh, investment channel. The, the nice thing about this sites, like you just saw, they've got an ability to reach over 300 million, right? That means they have got a, 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 the ability to send hundreds of thousands of uh, views a day, right? They can, you can finish your budget at the click of the fingers with this site, right? Um, so you can scale up anything which you want, but make sure that you test small and scale up big. That way you don't lose your shit. And another thing is, if you are making money, if the traffic is converting, there's absolutely zero to negotiate, let's say, a contract where they can send you traffic for a year. The growth is what it's very the potential to the traffic is it's almost unlimited, if you know what I mean. But you have to be very, very careful because now you are targeting demographics not like no niche specific, right? With most of these art sites, right? Because basically, if let's say the average of a person which you are looking for is between 25 to 55 business person, uh, will earn an income of between let's say um, 40,000 a year to let's say. 250,000 a year, you can basically pinpoint the kind of person you are looking for and take it from there. Excuse me, guys. Is this making sense, guys? I get excited about things like this and I can rumble on for hours. Is this making sense, guys? I'm just trying to lay a strong foundation so that you guys get, you know, the ins and outs of this. We're going to go through like contracts and all those things. So over the next three days, that's all. Even the next four days, that's all we are doing. If you look on, on the, if we look on, the, on, on here, right? It's a, here dealing with networks, that's all part of media buys. Uh, Google Display Media Buys, all of these are media buys, right? So we are going to be talking about what? Media buys for a little while because it's such a broad and important um, traffic source where you can just put your business on autopilot and really milk these things, right? Milk these things. So I'm going to drill down in your head everything. But I'm going to show you show you exactly how to do it. Then also, then on top of that, I, I'm going to show you the shortcut ways. Like I just showed you. Don't do, like guys, I keep on stressing this. Don't test, avoid testing with your own money. Find someone who's already succeeding with that and just rip off what they're doing. Don't just take everything as it is. Just make some minor changes, right? Just make some minor, minor, minor changes. Online is called swiping. Everyone does it. If you are not doing it, you are the only person not doing it. Make sure you swipe. So let, let's go on. 
Uh, these sites can deliver cheaper traffic than uh, you going to sites like Facebook, right? Facebook, YouTube. Uh, so, excuse me, guys. Uh, sorry about that, guys. Uh, then the next thing is most of these sites, they will require a lot of money, right? They deliver cheap traffic, but they require a larger commitment than you would um, dealing with sites like uh, Facebook and all those, right? Why? Like most of the sites I personally use, they want a minimum of commitment of 1,000 a day for them to be even what right, working with you. Uh, there are some very few where you can pay as little as 300 a day, 500 a day, some 25,000 a day. So it depends exactly with your budget, which determines how you're going to play. So that's an overview of these networks. So what I want you to do is, uh, what I want you to do is this. I need you to get this follow. It's a follow plugin, right? Um, it's a free plugin. I've got the upgraded version, the paid version. Uh, you can start with just uh, the plugin. If you invite a few people, they let you upgrade for free. So get follow. That's the first thing. And uh, go to to Yahoo. I don't want you to go. I, with me, I'll just use this. This is pretty expensive, so you don't need to worry about that. Go to sites like uh, Yahoo. Uh, I need Yahoo Home. What you do is you can go. Uh, I was looking for business. I see it say, only says finance. I hope it's the same thing. You'd go under finance. Go under most popular. Then what you do, you start looking at what the ads, right? What ads are people placing? What ads are people running on these sites, right? I don't see any ads on this one. Let's go one step back. I don't want to go under news. I want to stay under business. I see BMW. That's not the kind of ads I'm looking for. Normally, you also see them. The ads blended over here. I'm not seeing any ads. I don't know why. Only the ones which are irrelevant. Let's go under news. I guess I have to go on the home page to find what I'm looking for. I do want to go to the home page.
every other day I'm bombarded by ads. Today I can't find even a single ad to save my life. Guys, I'm looking for ads, as you can see. I can't find ads here, but if you go under... Oh, wait. Let's redo this. Oh, this is South Africa. Okay, I want yahoo.com. The US one, that's the one which I normally use. I normally use the American one. Okay, how do I get to my American one? I don't care about this South African one. I should be able to find ads now. Now, this is more like what I'm used to. All right, we should be able to find some advertisements. Some advertisements. Okay, can you see over here? This one should be an ad. Let's go down. This one, it's an ad, right? They are blended in, right? I need you to find some URLs and see exactly what they are doing. See where they are placing their ads. Okay, this is an ad over here. In the American version, you get bombarded by ads. I don't know in the South African version why people are not even targeting South Africa. A lot of people here in South Africa have got money, a lot of it. See this one? How to make an extra thousand a month, right? This is what we are looking for. But this is for credit.com. Right, let's see. We click on it. All you want, right? You want the URL which comes up on top, right? It's finance dot whatever. Uh, this is the site they're using Yahoo. I don't want this one. So I'm going to click again. Check out free or oh, this is just a credit score thing. We don't want that. Business and finance. Let's go somewhere. I'm looking for ads. But that was a nice little title. See this? These are all ads, right? This is an ad right here. Ad by ad. Ad choice. That's the network. This one here. So just find some ads. What we want we want the URLs. I want to know exactly the URLs where people are being taken to. Like this one, tradingbeautydaily.com, right? So we'll take this one, right? Go to follow, throw it in there, turn, and just do this. But make sure whatever you get is relevant. It's relatively a new site, you can see here. So there isn't much data. They're spending a lot of media. Okay. Networks, click booth. Targeting United Kingdom mainly. Their landing pages. Let's see their landing pages.
their ad, it's health related. I know it's not uh, specific to our niche. You are just learning to find out what other people are doing, just the process, that's all, right? So we found the kind of capture page which is working for them, right? Uh, we found, uh, what else did we find? The countries which they are mainly targeting, right? Which is United Kingdom. United States, I don't think it's number seven, right? They were different, whatever. You can see the ads which they are using, right? Now imagine when you get someone who's related to our niche, to the make money online, right? It's just walking into someone's who has already done the research for you. Does that make sense? It's very important to be able to re, to reverse engineer and cause on these sites, guys, you are spending big bucks. These sites they are not exactly exactly cheap. So anyone who's advertising here, they know what they are doing. They've got big budgets. So instead of you trying to watch, to match them, just copy what they are doing, right? Does that make sense? Just go and what fiddle around with the process, learn to what to see what other people are doing. Tomorrow, I'm going to start going into the steps required to place media, to actually place, to actually sit down and negotiate these things. Because you are going to have to negotiate these things with enough with your uh, manager, the account manager. Right, it's very, very, very important. So just look through, uh, just by looking through here. Let's find some more ads. I don't see any, but you see them blended in there so that they don't uh, really look like ads. But you should be able to find them when you really look and see it's an ad. But I think you get you got the point. So guys, I want you to find about three businesses where you can copy what they are doing just for you to be able to what? to know the process so that if you are getting confused tomorrow you can ask me again does that make sense because i'm going to be doing this for the next three days three more days so do you understand what i cover today guys And guys, don't try to copy my tools. I've got so, so, so many tools I use on a day-to-day -day basis. Any questions, guys? Oh, I placed uh, 40 ads yesterday. So far, only three have been approved. I'm waiting for the rest to be approved. I'm going to be asking for another link because... I'm getting a lot of traffic and I think I need to capture some of them because so far they were going through, uh, what you call it? Yeah, the banners are included in the search. Just uh, go to follow.net. Follow.net. It's one, it's a, it's a Google Chrome plugin can see my little one right here it's follow.net it's a free plugin only when you want full data you can upgrade with me I, I like full data to know everything about a company in everything I copy everything
Okay, guys, I'll see you tomorrow. We are going to go now to break down the media buys and see if it's for you or not for you, right? I don't see any questions, so guys, until tomorrow. Ciao for now.